You are welcome to buckle up and join us on a journey of discovery of the Jewish community in the USA through food. It's going to be funny, it's going to be interesting, it's going to be exciting, and it's going to be delicious. So maybe you should unbuckle your seatbelts. The Jewish foodie, lift up. At the first time we start the story, we start with a little bit of a joke. If a man is out of the way, not a Jew, but a lot of the community of the Jewish community in Wyoming. Hi, Oscar. Well, nice to meet you. I'm Ori. Oscar, today. Wow, the smell. Shalom, Tim. What are you going to make for the Jewish community? Ori, what are you going to make for the Jewish community? Shalom, Odiyafa. And I'm Anne. It's to see how the Jewish people. משתלבים בקהילה היהודית. יש פה שוקולטייר מהמם, והוא, לפני שש שנים, התחיל לעשות לקהילה היהודית מי חנוכה. So, I've heard that you're making the Hanukkah coins. When did it start? Like... It started about, I believe, six years ago, you know? Uh, the, the Jackson Hole Jewish community approached me, and, you know, so they showed me a little sample, and then uh, I say, well, we can do it, but we can do it better. I did the mold, you know, uh, I did the carving by hand, and then uh, I presented to them, and they love it. No? So since, I believe, six years ago, every year, we make about 3,000 coins wow. for, for them to, to help the community in, in Jackson. You know what we could do? Yes. I'm gonna make a coffee for you. I'm gonna invite you to the kitchen, and I will show you how do I do the goals for the Jewish community in Jackson Hole. It will be great. So we make your coffee now. What's inside this go. one? Raspberry. This one? Pistachio. This one? Juice. This one? Balsamic and honey. This one? Intense dark. This one? Hazelnut. This one? Cabernet reduction. This one? Mexican chocolate. Very unique. What the, the Jewish people like the most? They like it all. Ready for, for, for chocolate class? Yeah, let's work. This is the mold. Yep. J.H.J. Jackson Hall Jewish community. Right? And Oscar made it up. That's his idea. I'm just polishing the molds a little bit. We put the cocoa butter. Okay. Spray it like this. This, this. Yes. Very good. Now you have to make 600 of them today because I have a new order, okay? <laughs> Fill it. Now you shake it. We put it in the cooler now. Okay. So we have it in here. Zania City. I did the good I ones, did. he did the bad ones. He did the gold. Wow. Oscar, thank you so much. I'm going to take it with me to Israel. And I uh, want to thank you in the name of the Jewish community. Thank you. For doing that. You make a lot of kids happy in Hanukkah. Thank you very much, Chris. Anytime. Mi casa es tu casa. כן. אנחנו עכשיו הולכים לפגוש את הקהילה היהודית של ג'קסון הול. ולא רק זה, אנחנו הולכים לעשות איתם הבדחלה. בעצם זה שילוב של הבדלה וחלה. We're super excited to be together, to have our guests here from Israel. We're gonna make challah, we're gonna braid challah. We're gonna follow in what are our traditions and we've been, we've been doing as a, as a Jewish people for generations. Let's grab some dough, grab a spot, and let's make some challah. Oh my God, I'm like in a dream. I love this place. Thank 
את העניינים, מרי. I am the chief, I'm the boss. Um, I'm the executive director of the Jackson Hole Jewish community for 11 years, and I've been part of the community for 25. We started out over 50 years ago as just a group of Chavrim um, that got together. And now we've incorporated in about 25 years ago, and we have about 110, 115 families. How much is membership? It's $655. Do you have a discount? I'm very famous. I can do Instagram for no, you. No, but we have a child's discount. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little bit childish. Can I take your challah and say that I made it because it's so beautiful and I'm very clumsy? Thank you, you're a good friend. Then I met here children שממש ילדים מבשלים עם רות סירקיס, יודעים איך להכין בריסקית, כמה זמן, מה משרים. And then you marinate it usually the next morning. And you all morning know how to cook, right? I do know how no. to bake toast, but I don't know how to cook <laughs> on the oven. We had to look at what the Jews in America eat. A Jewish food, typical, called s'mores. The father of 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 the father. לוקח מרשמלו תפוח ועושה סמורז. Who wants to try? Thanks for bringing rose. That was great. That's my number five. Your loss is really good. Yeah. Hello, we want to welcome Ori to our community and the whole, the whole crew. And in particular, we wanted to have a chance to do Havdalah together, to think about separating the Sabbath, Shabbat, from the rest of the week, and to do that in community, in person. What a gift, what a, what a beautiful thing to do that all together. <laughs> It really moved me because in Israel, things are taken for granted. You know, like you sing on a Friday evening and you sing because that's a tradition. And here, to hear a small community sings together, the energy was crazy. And uh, I want to be a part of this community. You're always welcome. Welcome to Wyoming. <laughs> Amazing, and for me, your strength is uh, being such a small community in a small place. But I can really feel your energy, and um, it's magical. I want you to. I want to thank you.
ובסוף אתה מבין שאחרי כל האוכל הזה שאכלנו, בכל המקומות, בניו יורק, בממפיס, בטקסס, אתה מגיע פה למקום הזה, ודווקא הילדים הקטנים שעושים לך את החלות הקטנות האלה, זה הטעם של בית, ובסוף זה הדבר שהכי מרגש אותך. אחרי מסע ארוך ברחבי ארצות הברית, אני הבנתי שהאוכל הוא חלק בלתי נפרד מהקהילה היהודית-אמריקאית. התחלתי בניו יורק, וגיליתי איך היהודים הביאו לשם את האוכל היהודי והפכו אותו לחלק בלתי נפרד מהמטבח ומהתרבות האמריקאית. ככל שהתקדמתי במסע, גיליתי איך האוכל היהודי קיבל טוויסט אמריקאי מקומי. הכרתי קהילות שלא חשבתי שאי פעם אבקר בהן, ונחשפתי על המטבח הייחודי שלהן שמשתלב בתרבות המקומית. אני פגשתי חברים חדשים שהוכיחו לי שאפשר להרגיש הכי קרוב לבית פשוט באמצעות חברה טובה, אוכל ועוד כמה קילוגרמים נוספים למשקל. אני התחלתי את המסע הזה במחשבה אחת על יהדות ארצות הברית, שבעיקר מוכרת לי מהערים הגדולות כמו ניו יורק או לוס אנג'לס. אך לאורך המסע אני גיליתי טעמים שונים ויהדות מגוונת הרבה יותר ממה שחשבתי. בסוף, בזכות האוכל המסורתי והחדש, הרגשתי הכי בבית. נכון, אנחנו שונים אחד מהשני, ישראלים ואמריקאים, אבל גם עם הרבה עבר משותף ויכולת ליצור עתיד משותף. כי בסוף, אנחנו עם אחד. <עוד>